these little feet are learning to take what they do here off the mat. This is nine-year-old Alex Sloan's first class. My cousin, he doesn't take it easy on me. He'll play rough with me. I'll tell him to stop and he'll go harder. Instructor Yvonne Cifuentes says this discipline isn't about fighting at all. Here we teach them that there's rules uh, of engagement. There is no hitting or kicking in this jujitsu class. It's all about protecting yourself. We also want to make sure we maintain control and if we do use a technique, we want to make sure we use minimal force and um, negotiate with the bully. Cifuentes has seen the program build so much confidence in these children. Good job, Alex. She wanted to expand on the idea. Cifuentes took pen to paper and started scribbling down a short story about a Shih Tzu puppy named Leo who was being bullied. A poodle named Bon Bon took Leo under his wing, or paw, and taught him jujitsu. Leo shared his training with his friends. Leo was happy to show them what he learned from Bonbon. Bon. He taught them the principles of jiu-jitsu. Cifuentes says the book started as an idea. She never expected it to come to life so quickly. Some people are like, well, you're an author. I was like, yeah, you're right. But she says she believes this discipline has the power to transform lives. From then on, brave little Leo was forever known as the Shih Tzu who knew jiu-jitsu. And maybe even turn bullies into friends. Very good, Lily. In New Braunfels, Catherine Giese, Spectrum News.